Okay, we're recording. Who is it? What do you want? Do you have a warrant? Then I'm not obligated to speak to you, am I? Who am I speaking to? It's who? Do you have a warrant? No, just asking the question if everything's okay today. Do you have a warrant? I already answered the question. Do you have a warrant? I answer it again. I'm, you're, you're talking through a door and I'm hard to hear. Well, do you mind opening the door then? Yeah, I do. Do I have to open my door? Do you have a warrant? All right, well, then we can just speak through the door. That's fine. Um, of course it's fine. That's, that's called my constitutional rights. Today? That what? Uh, I'm pleading my Fifth Amendment rights. That means I no longer have to talk to you. Do you understand that? And being I explained to you that I'm uh, extending my Fifth Amendment rights at this point, that I, I demand to have a lawyer present. I'm, I'm exercising my Fifth Amendment right. I, I, I want a lawyer present. I'm, I'm, I'm not under any obligation to aid you in your investigation. And now that you know that I'm applying my rights, you stand the chance of losing qualified immunity. Okay it's not okay because you people don't understand. And you people are wasting precious community. If you would shut your mouth and listen, you people... Are, you see, that's your problem. You put that friggin' badge on and you think you know everything and you know nothing. That's okay. And the police, the police cost taxpayers millions of dollars every year in lawsuits. Fifth Amendment. Fifth Amendment. Fifth Amendment. Fifth Amendment. Okay, that's fine. Um, are you in any distress? Ronald, so we're only here because the, the hospital called us just because they wanted us to come and check you, just to just to talk to you, make sure everything was okay. Just okay, you've talked to me, everything's okay. Now, now hit the fucking bricks. Okay. Hit the fucking bricks, pal. You're dismissed. Okay, I don't have to leave. You do, you do, piece of shit. No, the reason you're here is because you're a tyrant, you're a thug, and somebody was butthurt at the fucking hospital and decided to file a false fucking police report. I'm sorry you feel that way. No, you're not sorry. You're not sorry about anything. If the one thing we know about the fucking police... Hey, hey, I, I got something for you. Do you know who Officer Chris Walls is, the meth manufacturer? Do you know who he is? I do. You do? Is he a buddy? Do you, or do you still get your meth from him? No, I don't. Do 40% of you still abuse your families? Nope. Yes, you do. I don't. Well, I don't believe that for a second. Police are not obligated to tell the truth. Okay. It's called the ruse. Okay. You people are fucking liars. The no, the reason that you're here is because you're a thug and you're trying to throw your fucking weight around. Well, you already know who the fuck I am, so why the fuck are you bothering me? Ronald, do you have any thoughts of hurting yourself or others? You call me by my surname, it's Mr. Eaton, you piece of shit. Okay, Mr. Eaton, do you have any thoughts of hurting yourself or others? I'm, I'm pleading the, f the fifth, and no, I do not. So you don't have any thoughts of hurting yourself or others? I just answered the question, you stupid ass. What the fuck is wrong with you? I'm confused because you said you were pleading the fifth, and then you answered my question. Okay, well, then the fifth. Okay, bye-bye. Fifth Amendment. Oh, you know what you can do? What's that? How can I help you? I see. Oh, I see who you are. I see the red light. You know, I wish you had the, the cameras rolling that day. You kicked my fucking door in and dragged me out of here, you cocksuckers, and robbed my fucking house. You motherfuckers. I tell you what. You want to do something? You want to be professional and, and, and bring credit to your, your people? Leave your business cards right on the railing, right outside the door. Please leave your business cards so when I come down to file a, a Freedom of Information Act to find out who you are, why you're here, 
and get the records for this, I know who I'm dealing with and I know who I'm filing against. I, I already know why you're here. Because some piece of shit was butthurt and they mobilized their personal fucking thugs, the Long Branch pigs. And believe me, I can say pig. That's First Amendment right. That's protected activity. And you know that. You know that. No, it's not okay. I didn't say it was okay. I said okay. You said okay. That's what that's what police Okay. 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 Now what else can I do for you? I mean, you can come and talk to us and just let us know that How many pe how many of you are out there? Four of us. Then talk to each other. We're not here to talk to each other. Though. Well, you ain't here to talk to me. I already played the fifth. So fuck yourself. Put your fucking warrant under the door or get the fuck out of here. You're harassing me now. You're violating my Fourth Amendment rights right this second. You are. Police are liars. Okay. Have a good day. Uh, you see these cocksuckers are right at the door. This will this will be up on YouTube. See those dirty, filthy bastards are still out there.
It's four o'clock on the dot. I have every reason to believe they're going to kick the door in. I know this seems boring, but they're still outside that door, and I'm not about to shut this off. I got my battery back up on. Let's see what happens if I do this. Oh, take it down. Twenty minutes. 
That's where the taxpayer money is going for these jerk-offs to stand outside my fucking door.
That's them right there. See, so they're still here. The pigs are still here. Corn number three. And there's another one. There's another car. Right there. So these pigs are still here. See, these stupid pigs will stand out here forever. They'll change fucking shifts. I don't give a flying fuck. This is harassment. <laughs> this is fucking harassment. This is a violation of my fucking Fourth Amendment. These pigs standing out here.
that I'm being held here in my apartment. It's a good thing I got that taped. I got more than that. I got audio and videos. So the conversation between me and that, that fucking scumbag at Mammoth Medical Centers is on tape. I had to record it. See, and they're just standing around out here to intimidate. That's it. They don't like it when you use your right, your Fifth Amendment right, First Amendment right. They hate it. Especially that Fourth Amendment right. Boy, they hate that. No fucking warrant. No probable cause. What, because I called the hospital and talked to Mike? Yeah, all right.
just waiting for this door to come crashing in. Like I said, I'm just waiting for that door. Those pigs are still sitting out there. As long as those pigs are still sitting out there, I'd be a fool to fucking turn this fucking camera off. Still sitting there. Look, look, look. They're all waiting for them to come out. Dragging somebody behind them. Pigs still sitting right there. And there's probably a couple more. <laughs> Nobody likes a pig. See, they're out there intimidating everybody in this fucking place. Their presence just makes life difficult, difficult for everybody here.
43 minutes. Oh, shit.
51 minutes. Let's see if the pigs are still out there. I think they left, you can't be sure, especially where pigs are concerned. Don't see the cars and I listen I got no respect for the police none none they, they don't know the first thing about the law they don't they're they're there to uh, abuse you violate your fucking civil rights that's what they're there for they're, they're there to take money from you for the government and no son of a bitch has stood out here trying to intimidate me. And they were sent by Monmouth Medical Center, by the way. And I told you about the problems with them, the scumbags, the absolute fucking scumbags at Monmouth Medical Center. Fucking scum. So, I'm li I, I, I live on the edge. I, I, I can't put up these videos, me chasing these fucking cops around. They're armed to the teeth, they'll kill you. They'll, they'll stop you for no reason whatsoever. They're, they're child, I'm going to use the word photographers, same thing. They're child photographers. And, the, and you would think that they had something better to do today, like uh, go check on lemonade stands or something so that they look like fucking heroes. Or go shoot somebody's dog. Or shoot somebody's cat. These cops are morons. They really are. Oh, 53. I'll give it a couple more minutes and then I'm gonna try and go live on YouTube and uh, report on this. An, an hour long video, Christ man. For me to upload that from my phone to YouTube is gonna probably take about seven days. So, fuck these cops. Fuck Monmouth Medical Center and their bullshit. Cocksuckers. They got more problems there. You got more problems with the police department. Child, child, child photographers, drunks, drug addicts, wife beaters. That's what the police do. Drink lemonade. Take bribes. Gratis food. They like to eat a, a lot of free food. They like to ask for that ID. You see, you see they, they, they already knew who I was when, when they came here. So, oh, we have to talk to you. You yeah, fuck you. Fuck your mother, too. Piece of shit. Piece of fucking garbage. Your parents are fucking garbage. They, they put prototypes like you on this planet to, to, to fuck with decent citizens. This ain't going, this, this, this will be on YouTube, I guarantee it. As, as a matter of fact, it'll be global because my connections with the uh, accountability community. Just, literally global. Cops got their brains way, way, way up in their asses. Uh-oh, I hear voices. Who is it? Ron, it's Brianna from Pest. It's who? Brianna. Brianna what? From Pest. What's your last initial? What? What's your last initial in your name? Pardon me? C as in Charlie. I, my, my hearing is so bad. I'm sorry. Okay, that's okay. So, 
One, 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 one of you Brianna Cheese names uh, hates the hell out of me. So, uh, listen, I have uh, Fifth Amendment rights. I have Fourth Amendment rights. And right now, you're violating my Fourth Amendment rights. Uh, the pigs have been here and uh, for I don't know how long, and they're just upsetting this community. And, and that's what they do. They, you know, they should be out inspecting lemonade stands right now, taking pictures of children, beating their wives running people over like Jake Pescucci or manufacturing methamphetamines like uh, Chris Walls. That what? Is is that illegal, ma'am? Is that illegal? No, I'll call them anytime I want. That's called discrimination. You're violating my rights right now. Yes, you are. I, they, right, and I call when I got to talk to somebody. That's all there is to it. So I don't need your bullshit. I don't need your fucking mouth. I don't need anything. Okay. And you know what? The least you could do is act professionally when I call up. I do. No, you don't. Okay. If your last initial isn't C, like in uh, ABC, ABC, then you're one of the people that just can't stand me. Typically, so so why aren't you taking my back right now and advocating for me? Oh, you have a job to do. Okay, so did I break any laws? Did I didn't harass anybody? I didn't call to argue with anybody. Your staff decided to take that path instead of de-escalating. What'd you do? You sent guns over here again, didn't you? You sent guns over here, didn't you? Okay, Ron, I'm gonna go. You sent guns over here, didn't you? Okay. You sent guns over here. Okay. I suggest you take your fucking shitty civil servants, your, your public servants, and get the fuck off of this property because the police are dismissed. They're violating my Fourth Amendment rights right now. I didn't break any laws, and if your staff has all of these emotional problems, talk to each other. Talk to each other. Right, Don't come over here and ask me to counsel your sick, sorry fucking asses. Good thing I didn't, see? It's a good thing I kept recording. You gotta record these motherfuckers. I didn't break any laws, nothing. And they did. They broke the laws. Wait, when they decided because they're butthurt, and it's all on tape, it's all on tape. Fuck them. So if somebody on a crisis line can't handle a curse word and, and, and they're, they're, they're in crisis and they got to send guns over, that's a shame. That's what they were doing. They were waiting for one of these fucking assholes to get over here. They should have sent Mike over. They could have sent Mike. They could have sent fucking... Alexa, they could have sent... There's another breed that I get along with. They could have sent her. But instead, they sent this piece of shit. I, and again, I couldn't hear the uh, first letter of her last name. There is a Brie, but her last name starts with a C. And she's been very nice to me. So is Mike, so is Eileen, so is a bunch of... But when you call them, you got to remember that you're dealing with some sick fucks. Just like the police department, when you call the police department, you're you're sending somebody, some lunatic with a fucking gun and a big ego problem over, you know, you're, that's what you're calling on because these cops don't know the first thing about the fucking law. Not the first motherfucking thing that they know about the law. They, they know that, oh, you can tell it to a judge. You can appeal it. So what they know how to do is... Abuse taxpayers. That's that's what the police know how to do. And, th and that's why qualified immunity has to be abolished so that you could go after these cops individually. You could take their pensions. 
You can take their property, just like the government does to you. The government will not bat an eye destroying you financially. They won't bat an eye if, if it comes to killing you either. They kill so many innocent people every year. It's crazy. And this, this is going to be on YouTube. Sorry. Here, one hour, one something. One hour, one minute, 40 something. So, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's see what we got here. Here, I just had to plug my power supply back in. You see, if I would have stopped recording... Here, boom. If I would have stopped recording, I would have had no proof that they did what they did. So fuck these people. Scumbags. Yeah, that Brianna's a real piece of shit. As soon as, as soon as they get a little upset, they got the fucking police. Right away, gotta send the fucking police. Oh my god. This is a mistake. I'm going to shut this off and see if I could go live.